More breaking news coming in on the broadcast. Addressing the Golden Jubilee Convocation of IIT Delhi, ISRO Chief Sivan Sechandrian 2 is not the country's last attempt at landing on the moon and that the agency will make another attempt in the near future. You all have heard about Chandrayaan 2's mission, he said. We could not achieve the soft landing, but all systems functioned until 300 meters from the moon's surface. Very valuable data is available to set things right. ISRO will put all its experience, knowledge and technical prowess to set things right and demonstrate soft landing in the near future." Unquote. Before the convocation address, Sivan signed a memorandum of understanding with the Institute for setting up a space technology cell at IIT Delhi. Uh, ISRO will jointly set up the space technology cell in the campus. All have heard about Chandrayaan 2 mission. On the technology part, yes, we could not achieve soft landing, but all the system functioned up until 300 meters from moon surface. Very valuable data is available to set things right. Let me assure that ISRO will put, a, put in all effort experience, knowledge and technical prowess to set things right and demonstrate the soft landing in near future. And the Chandrayaan 2 is not the end of story. Our plans on Aditya L1 solar mission, human spaceflight program are on track. A large number of advanced satellite launches are planned in the coming months. The small satellite launch vehicle will make its maiden flight sometimes in early next year. Testing of 200 ton semi-cryogenic engine is expected to begin shortly. Work is on to provide navic signals on the mobile phones, which will open the path to develop a large number of applications for societal needs. Joining me on the broadcast is my colleague Sabya Sachi with more details. Sabya, take us through uh, the latest on what Sivan's uh, uh, out uh, plan for ISRO in the near future. Well, ISRO Chief uh, K. Sivan has clearly made the statement that uh, the Chandrayaan 2 will again uh, try another soft landing in the moon. So they have not given up by the small failure. So it was just a soft landing that we couldn't achieve. But clearly all the uh, equipments were functioning out there. We are still the orb uh, orbiter is revolving around the moon and we are constantly getting valuable information about the moon and uh, we are getting a great uh, valuable information as well as pictures of the moon. So clearly we have achieved a lot. So we'll clearly in near future will try another soft landing and along with that he has also uh, done a great job where he has established uh, set up a unit in IIT Delhi where he'll be uh, encouraging the students and sharing the ideas of, of, of space uh, satellites and everything. So it's a very good move because uh, these youngsters can uh, often come up with great ideas that can uh, at the end will be a lot of help to ISRO and India as well. And he also spoke about uh, introducing the small satellite uh, uh, SSLV that is small satellite launch vehicle and it will take its maiden launch and along with that Aditya LV and he's also talked about uh, human uh, spacecraft where human uh, will be sent in the space for the research uh, as well right. as other uh, developments that he spoke about so there are various range of uh, uh, satellites that will be launched in the near future so isro is working on different sorts of plan whether they're working on the uh, solar plan will be uh, they'll be launching a satellite uh, will be uh, uh, they also spoke about All right, thank uh, you uh, uh, for joining us on the broadcast for more such videos subscribe to the newsx youtube channel hit the bell icon